Alright, may this dog eat the rest of Just leave. Just leave. Just leave. We don't care. Anytime that you like, I'm giving my heart to break. Not only the John Speedless, all that's in Michigan Street, please raise your high for speed. United Kingdom, ROK, Italy, Logan, China, USSR, in that order. Give your left to a random target that the chair will not remember the order. All of us are chairs in the United Kingdom stands here to um, propose a possible solution that will probably benefit both sides. The delegates of, actually, in one side, honestly. Um, the delegates of the United Kingdom would like to propose a joint armed forces in order to retaliate against um, the forces of DPRK, People's Republic of China, and USSR. It is not the most efficient way, however, it is one of the best ways um, the delegate could think of that will not, hopefully, cause a World War III. On the next delegate, you have 35 seconds remaining. I would like to use your remaining time. The delegate of the UK has just stated that they want to avoid World War III, but if it is not creating an armed forces and sending them over to the Korean Peninsula, in fact creating another uh, world war. Uh, Yes, the delegate understands why the delegate of France might think of that. However, it is much better than dropping a nuclear weapon in the territory of the enemy as the hope that surely the allies of that enemy country will retaliate back leading to a massive dominance. Uh, Follow-up? Okay, so this, the delegate of the UK uh, holds more firmly to the stance that they should send armed forces or to the fact that they should avoid conflict and in, in, in fall in theory another World War III. If the logo of DPRK were to actually going to respond to a negotiation, then the logo of the DPRK would not have um, the Thank you, delegate. We now are trying to speak to China for last. The next delegate, we have folks reporting me. Ah, chair, but it's too cold. It's delegate, your time begins now. Honorable Chair, the delegate. The delegate for OK would like to raise a high concern about the uh, the uh, main argument that they, the del that delegate is specifically open for negotiation. However, this delegate of ROK strongly believes that, uh, that such a negotiation will not be possible unless the DPR, uh, DPRK's armed forces in Korea are completely, uh, com completely went back to their own, own territory. With that situation, the delegate of ROK is open for such negotiations. Um, thank you, delegate. You have Elliot, we now return to your seat. The delegate of PRC will be now approached to board meeting. Delegate, your time begins now. Um, points of privilege. Watch the agenda right now. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> no. <laughs> North Korean war. North Korean war. North Korean war. You're triggering like a thousand million people. <laughs> the Korean war is a current agenda and finding solutions to it. The delegate of people's PRC wants to say, um, definitely I agree with the delegate of France that <laughs> uh, <laughs> we have our delegates. We have also a solution for Korean War would uh, be negotiation between DPRK and Republic of Korea um, without any companions. <laughs> you sold the USSR. You have been right there. Please approach the podium. The time begins now. On behalf of the great Soviet Union, this delegate of USSR would like to say that he is boycotting this meeting until PRC is recognized as a country <laughs> and as the China and the one and only China. And would also like to caution. Uh, PRC by saying that he should reconsider his stance on agreeing with USA. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Minato, for the seat. Now I got a DPRK. We can now approach the podium. May the delegate adopt a British accent. No. The delegate is, with permission from the chair, allowed to adopt the British accent. <laughs> the other DPRK, you may now begin. It will be recommended by the chair to use a North Korean accent. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> this delegate believes that all the other delegates are just assuming that negotiations are not possible. 
However, the saga once again stated that he is always open to negotiations and that no other countries have responded to the saga's term that uh, requires Kim Il-sung's dignity to be maintained and the Korean government structure to be maintained as well. And also, this delegate has a very intimate relationship with the delegate of USSR, meaning that this delegate can request USSR to nuke uh, South Korea as well. So, if the delegate is willing to nuke this country, then this delegate is also willing to nuke South Korea. This delegate hopes that this will clarify his points. Thank you. Thank you, delegate. You've turned down a lot. You now return to your seat. Um, this is now a procedural vote that we're trying to make a Admin and staff are not securing the doors at this period of time. The so little pan may enter. I'll be the admin staff. Deeper in all your s. Last one, there's a little bit of four people to come to the side. One, two, three, that doesn't. Four. Are you serious? serious? That's kind of a bad Four delegates. <laughs> All delegates are shooting for the game. So now we'll to the general speaking for all those who speak. Please raise your tactics high. Uh, France, UK, and Soviet Union. France, we are close to 40 years. During the war, the US was bombing uh, Japan daily uh, using firebombs, which are just as deadly, if not more effective, than nuclear bombs. And the presence of a new weapon did not threaten the Japanese government. It was rather a guise to sh not show weakness when the Allies fell. And this, of course, was very convenient for the country of the United States, as it made the United States the heroes of World War II. And this delegate of France would also like to question the United Kingdom's stance on uh, sending armed forces yet preventing World War III. The delegate uh, finds them to be complete opposites of each other. Had sending armed forces uh, immediately after another world war, made this delegate remind other members of this conference, would not only harm all the countries involved, including the DPRK, it serves no means to an end. The DPRK would continue to feel uh, disrespected and that the Kim Il sung was not honored. And therefore, this delegate believes that fighting head on is not the correct solution for this agenda. This delegate of France would then like to propose conceding to the DPRK and let them have their government and let the PRC and the USSR control the Korean Peninsula for a little while. This delegate would like to remind them that no individual country has any power unless the other countries of the world you know, recognize them. And conceding to uh, the DPRK and not letting World War III happen as the UK is in favor of is in fact the, the better stance to take. Let the countries uh, recover after World War II. And then when the DPRK is more open for negotiations after their power has been established, then we can come up with a more uh, suitable solution. And therefore this delegate of France is, uh, is promoting either conceding to the DPRK or at least giving in to some of the DPRK's demands in order to prevent a uh, wider scale conflict during this time. Uh, thank you. I in some. In some. I'm going to your seat. Okay. The reason um, World War I started was because the Allies attacked the country that has initially um, conducted the um, assassination. Also, to answer the delegation of France's concern, the reason why the delegate of the United Kingdom would said that they want to have an armed uh, combined armed forces was because it's the way to um, respond to the surprise attack by DPRK. So, in order for um, the delegates and the Allied forces to appropriately respond to it, was to have an al Allied forces and to retaliate back. And now, this is no way means that um, the delegate intends on starting a World War III, which the delegate has um, mentioned its concern that it will probably start a spark a World War III. Thank you. The delegate of DPRK said that um, in that content, the delegate of DPRK will ask USSR to nuke South Korea. Such intense arguments are both dealing with the of race, and also as a country who is currently being discussed on, it is really, really, really concerned about this, about this content. Uh, the delegate would like to mention such contradiction that the delegate of DPRK has raised. The delegate of DPRK has raised that negotiation will com completely have take place, uh, completely will take place when DPRK's demand or the, the, uh, the Kim Il Sung is further honored. However, this, uh, the delegate of, of ROK understood this content as a um, country and complete disregard against the uh, delegate of ROK, uh, ROK's government.
The delegate of ROK would like to uh, raise a concern about the environmental issues that further uh, further and uh, use the nuclear weapon will uh, provide. Delegate <coughs> now turn to your seat. Thank you. Delegate USSR, you now approach the podium. This delegate is still sad to see that TRC has not been recognized as an official country. This delegate would also like to note that um, there is little progress in the discussion for reaching a solution and this Delegate believes that the USSR is a major superpower that is a significant part of this conflict and would like to be involved in this discussion. But until PRC is recognized as an actual country, this delegate will be boycotting the meeting. <laughs> Thank you, delegate. You now have your seat. Um, okay, delegates, the jazz speakers list has now elapsed. Before moving on to the next round, the speakers are ready for some more time. Motion. Motion. Uh, you okay? Uh, motion to adjourn the session. That is an order on the chair's discretion that something needs done. Yay! Yay! Yay. Oh. <laughs> 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 Boycott. 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 Boyc